The Louds are going back to school. And all their school supplies should be in this closet. And now all their school supplies are in a giant pile on the floor. Let's go through and see who gets what in the Loud House Back to School Supplies Guide. Okay, let's dig in. What is this? A robot? Say hello to Todd. He's fluent in over 600 languages. Hola, bonjour, guten tag, goodbye. Um, okay, no robots in class. Okay, wait, why is there a picture of Bobby in here? Actually, this is perfect. Since Lori can't use her phone in class, if she misses Bobby, she can just look at this picture. Bobby! Let's move on. What else do we have in here? Oh, a nice blue dress. Let's give this to Lenny. As the stylish one in the fam, she needs to have a fresh outfit for the first day of school. Ooh, when did we put a mirror in the living room? That's not a mirror, that's me. Now go take your dress back. What? No, you take yours back. Uh-oh, Lori and Lenny can't wear the same thing on the first day of school. Not a good look. I know, how about Lenny takes this scarf to jazz up her back to school look? Done and done. Let's rummage through some more. Ooh, a marker kit. This can go to Lola and bonus points, it can act as an impromptu makeup kit. See, I don't even need a mirror to put my makeup on. Oh no, that will not do. I know, let's give Lola these cool shades. She and Lana were given hall monitor duty this year. No running in the hallway! Huh? What are you talking about? Lana, is this maggot giving you a lip? We're the new hall monitors at school, so we're practicing at home. Okay, what else? Symbols? I guess these can go to Luna. You should do this! His ears will be ringing for days! Wow, that might be too loud, even for band practice. I know, let's give Luna this pen and paper. That way she can write some letters to her crush. See you later, Sam. Okay, see ya! Ah, uh, okay, let's see. Ooh, a lab kit! This can go to Lisa so she can do awesome experiments in science class. The garbage and my chemicals have fused, creating a scientific breakthrough. I call him Homo Trashilius. Or Trashy for short. <laughs> okay, Lisa can have the lab kit, but Lisa, promise us, no radioactive monsters in the classroom. No time for that. I'm this close to synthesizing an antidote for streptococcal pharyngitis. Street name, Strep Throat. Oh, look, we found Mr. Coconuts. But Luann can't bring him to class. He's been known to disrupt lessons before. How do you make an egg roll? I don't know. How do you make an egg roll? You push it. Good one, Mr. Coconuts, but your delivery was a little wooden. <laughs> Let's give Luann these business cards for funny business. It's always good to network, and she can do younger students' birthday parties. What did one plate say to the other? Lunch is on me. <laughs> Okay, what are we going to find next? Oh, cool, a new backpack. Lincoln can have this because Charles ate his old one. Plus, he can bring some comics in to read at recess. Woohoo! It's New Comic Wednesday. What is this giant thing? A coffin? This is definitely Lucy's, and she definitely can't bring it to school. But we can give her this notebook so she can write her poetry in English class. Melancholy night before a hopeless dawn. The sun is rising soon, but all my joy is gone. Cheer up, Luce. They're going to love that one at Poetry Club. Okay, next up we have this big bag of something. What's in here? A tennis ball, a tennis racket, a soccer ball, a basketball, a baseball, a baseball mitt, and a baseball helmet. Woo! That was a workout just listing all of those. These go to Lynn because she plays every single sport. No soccer balls, no footballs, no baseballs, no balls. Good thing I brought my own! That's a no-brainer. So what about Lana? A socket wrench? Oh, right! She has to help Principal Huggins fix his car because of the froggy fiasco last year. Well, it appears your house is frog-free, so I'll be on my way. I'll just grab your coat? <gasps> I'll grab my own coat. What is wrong with you two? Nothing. Drive safe. 
What the? Where? Where? What? What? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I think that's it. The Louds are ready for school. Now, we forgot Lily, but she's not in school yet, so she gets bent in the box. Cheer up, baby, don't you cry. No more tears, it's cheer up time. Laugh with me and we will be happy, happy, happy. <gasps> the demon toy! I thought you got rid of that! I thought you did! <laughs> Thank you.